Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's R2s. In this video, I'll be showing you Olama vs Lama.cpp, which is the best local AI tool. Before we start, hurry up and check out these offer just under this video. Let's get started. So if you're de deciding between Olama.cpp or Olama, well, there are a few things here that you may want to know. Let's start with Lama.cpp. Now, this is the original low-level C++ library designed for running Llama models locally. Its biggest strength is the efficiency. It can run on just uh, about anything, from high-end desktops to Raspberry Pi boards. You get full control over how the model runs with options like quantizations to shrink model size and optimize speed. Now, it's perfect if you want to squeeze maximum performance out of limited hardware or fine-tune every aspect of the setup. Now, the trade-off is that it's command line heavy and not beginner friendly, so you need some technical comfort to really make the most out of it. But for power users, developers, and tinker, uh, tinkerers, it's incredibly versatile. Now, what about Olama? Now, think of Olama as the easy mode for running Llama models. It's actually built on top of Llama.cpp, but wraps it up in a super friendly package. Now, instead of dealing with uh, complex commands, you just install Olama pull a model like Llama Tree or Mistral and start using it almost instantly. It supports GPU acceleration and has a clean API for app integration and lets you customize models without the heavy technical lifting. It's perfect for beginners and people who want fast deployment or developers who need something quick and reliable without spending hours on configuration. Now, bottom line here is uh, Llama.cpp is best for full control low uh, resource setups, and technical users who want maximum performance and flexibility. Now, Olama here is best for ease of use, quick setup, and app integration, especially if you don't want to deal with command line complexity. But that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button, and watch our next video.